Mark, it's been a whirlwind month or so. It's our first chance really to sit down and speak to you, but how have you found this first few months uh, being involved with Wanderers? Uh, yeah, quite exhilarating actually, um, but fun. Uh, it has been whirlwind, but um, you know, I think it's, uh, it's really good to get involved, if you like, in the, at the deep end, um, first of all. Um, lots to throw ourselves into. Been very exciting, mainly on the um, the business restructuring side and planning for the future. So um, you know that's all been sort of taking in place alongside the immediate requirements because we've had obviously quite a whirlwind getting ready for this uh, first game of the season. How are you finding the vibe around the place? Because obviously there's been so many exciting signings on the pitch with Gareth, a lot of developments yeah. off the pitch, yeah. uh, and it's all coming together now, ready yeah. for the big kickoff. Fa fantastic vibe. They they tell me um, the place has been uplifted. I can't really. Um, judge that because uh, I wasn't here previously but um, look you know great people at the club I think everybody's uh, you know pulled, pulled along and, and mucked in as much as they, 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 they can do a great set of staff both on this side on the football side and obviously at, at the club side and you know we're really looking forward to taking that take, taking that to the next step which is Saturday. There's obviously been quite a lot of changes in a short space of time, a major yep. one being the new ticketing system, yep. uh, very exciting new cloud technology, QR mm -hmm. codes, mm -hmm. um, it might take some getting used to for supporters, yep. a real first chance to check it out on Saturday and, and hopefully get more people buying online. Yeah, look, we felt that was important to get the, the ticketing system in because I think it, it sets a precedence of change and, and positive change as well and it, it is a great system as a positive um, step forward. Um, there may be you know, one or two issues like anything with a, with a new system so we just ask our fans to bear with us uh, on that uh, for the longer term and what I would say is um, get, you know get early to the game on Saturday and make sure you're in and um, you know you've got your, either your ticket on your on your iPhone which you can have now or printed out with a QR code which is scanned um, when it's working through um, eventually it will be a, a lot easier system and you can do a lot more things on it which I won't go into now but um, that, that we'll be bringing some additions alongside um, the, the ticketing aspect. And I suppose sometimes those problems and, and feedback help actually improve products and, and help improve the offering over yeah. time. So actually, fans yeah. giving their feedback and, yeah. and, and comments yeah. are going to yeah. help the whole. I process. mean, we, we all, yeah, we always appreciate that um, feedback and comments. In fact, we, we did we did have a dry run, it, so to speak, with the Brentford friendly. Um, that actually went um, better than I thought with the ticketing system. I wanted a few more issues before Saturday, but um, look, we, we, we'll try and run it as seamlessly as possible. We are staffing areas more than we would do normally. But again, I'd ask if um, basically if people can get it, get there early, that would that would help us all out. And above all, you must be looking forward to taking your seat at three o'clock with loads of fans having successfully got into the stadium. You can relax, unwind a little bit, and watch a game of football with yeah. uh, some exciting new signs. Well, yeah, absolutely. I mean, the, the new signings are fantastic. Um, you know that Gareth, that Gareth and the staff here have done a fantastic job, a great job. And look, we we just helped to 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 endorse that really and to to, to help him. Um, you know, the the signings have been uh, exciting. I think they're all fitting very well into the in, into the team. And yeah, really looking forward to three o'clock and getting the season underway. And finally, I know you're in regular contact with Rob Kuwig. He'll be over here on Saturday. Yes, uh, he will. How's, yeah. how's his uh, nerves, excitement levels? Uh, he's he's jealous because he said I want he wants to be in my place here at the moment. He wants to be over here, but obviously, it, it's difficult for him to be over um, all the time. Although he will be a regular face at the club, uh, and he will be going around meeting people. He's a he's a he's a people's person, Rob, um, and very true to his word. So I think you know the the relationship with the club and Rob. I think the fans will find that excellent and he'll be over here on Saturday.